This is a short video to explain how pop-ups work. Each computer has its own settings. Those settings are within your power and not within the power of LAN or the technologists who work for LAN. If you go to questionnaires and you select a categorization questionnaire, it becomes available for completion. I have set this computer so that pop-ups are blocked. If your pop-ups are blocked, you will experience the problem that I'm about to experience now. You answer the question and press submit. You will see that it says pop-ups are blocked. To see this pop-up or additional options, click here. So if you press temporary allow that, The pop-up will be allowed, but when you go to submit it further, having checked the answer, it just goes back to the questionnaire. The problem here is not with the system, with eSystems, or with Lloyd's Action now. The problem is with the computer. The computer is blocking the pop-ups. I'm going to disable pop-ups and then you'll be able to see the difference. This is how to disable the pop-up blocker using Internet Explorer. 90% of persons use Internet Explorer and we recommend that you use Internet Explorer, particularly version 8, the latest version. If there's a later version that comes out, we suggest that you use that. This is Internet Explorer. You go to the toolbox, the toolbar, and you click the down arrow. You will see it says pop-up blocker. You simply click turn off pop-ups. Are you sure you want to turn off pop-up blocker? Yes, I'm sure. Pop-ups are now disabled and I will now show you that when I try to access the document the pop-ups are not a problem. You will remember that I tried to complete a questionnaire with the pop-up blocker on. The document got stuck and would not co complete uh, when I pressed submit. The document was stored, but the PDF version, the pop-up version, was not produced. I was able to temporarily unlock the pop-ups being blocked, but the document did not complete to finalization. The documents are stored in the um, documents folder of the inbox and can be accessed by clicking on the tab but they could not be printed. If I now go I then show you how to disable the blocker and the blocker has now been disabled. If I now go to the pop-up to the questionnaires with the pop-up blocker disabled in other words, pop-ups are allowed, and I complete a questionnaire, and I press submit. There is no problem. The document automatically generates for me to confirm and submit, and it automatically translates into a witness statement, no problem whatsoever. That is because the pop-up blocker has been disabled. Once again, if you are experiencing problems in this regard, it is within your power to solve it. We cannot sell, solve this for you because it is a security setting on your own computer. We recommend that you use Internet Explorer version 8 or newer version when they come out. You go to the Tools link. Pop-ups, pop-up blocker will appear. You press the link where it says disable pop-up pop blocker or enable pop-ups and your computer will give you no problems in future in relation to the um, accessing of documents which are generated by way of a pop-up. There is an explanation on the website by Qantas Airlines, the Australian airline which obviously also experiences problems in this regard because users are unable to print their tickets 
because their own computer security settings pop block pop-ups. So it is within your power to make your computer work according to the internationally accepted standard whereby pop-ups are not blocked. Thank you.